Hey Excess, it's Byron here and today I wanted to talk about owning everything about you. Part of owning our faith in God is owning who we are and accepting it. A part of that is owning things about yourself that may be a bit quirky or a bit weird or maybe you just don't like. Maybe you have a weirdly shaped big toe or a strange obsession with sour straps from the canteen or maybe you jump sideways in the mosh pit. Many people seem to go about their life with a kind of facade. The truth, however, is that most of us wish we were different somehow, and sometimes that means more like other people. While it's okay to admire good traits in others, often this desire to be like someone else is actually a form of envy. However, a faith in Christ requires us to accept who we are, and doing so allows us to move forward in our relationship with God. I'm sure many of you would have heard the news about our recent Australian of the Year, Dylan Alcott. In a recent interview with the press, he got asked how he felt growing up as a disabled person in sport. His words in response were, It was at this moment that I accepted who I was, that I was able to move forward and become a better person and athlete. Likewise, if we wish to grow in our relationship with God and develop into good Christians, we must first accept who we are. Before you can truly accept yourself, however, you need to see the truth about yourself recognizing both the gifts and the limitations that God's given you. If you don't, you will constantly struggle to be someone you're not. One way to appreciate how God has made you is to read Psalm 139 verse 14. The psalmist rejoices, Thank you for making me so wonderfully complex. Your workmanship is marvelous and how well I know it. Each of us is unique and specially embraced and accepted by God himself, even though not one of us is perfect. Let us pray. God, help me to have self-acceptance and be at peace with you who made me to be. We pray for support as many of us return to school, both online and in person. We pray for safety through these dangerous times with COVID rampaging about. We hope for a successful return to excess. Amen. How good. I hope you guys got something from this, and I'll see you all when excess comes back. Don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel and follow all the socials. Peace out, guys.